Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be giving my kids closet tour and this room is my office and we have a cupboard in this corner and you guys must have seen this as a backdrop of my other videos. And in case you're wondering what this is, this is these are like foldable mattresses. It looks kind of ugly. We just fold it and keep it as a seater and I'm planning to cover it up using a throw blanket. And this wall over here was like bare and I recently purchased these paintings and um, we last week we got around to actually hang it on the wall and it was looking okay. So I purchased these wall stickers from Amazon and gave it a bit of personality. Anyway, so this is the cupboard and it has two sides. One of the sides has all my sister's clothes. Uh, she used to live here before she got married and the other side is where I keep my son's clothes and stuff. And the print on the closet is something I chose from shutterstock.com, I think. The interior designing guys use this website because it does not have any copyright issues while choosing the print. And they printed this on the matte finish doors. I really, really like it. Now let's start with the closet. Uh, let me give you a full view first so that you will, you guys will have an idea how it looks. I keep it extremely tidy and hassle free always and should always look pleasing to the eye, you know. I actually personally designed the cupboard structure based on my convenience so I'm pretty satisfied with how it actually turned out. So the biggest section here is I put in the rods and to hang the clothes and stuff and I am extremely happy I can put other bits and bobs as well on the platform. And this side I have hanged all his party wear, smart clothes and all uh, and most of his clothes are gifted by family and friends so we mothers are extremely lucky in that sense. And uh, yeah. And this side is where his uh, party wear, kurtas and sherwanis and all those other jazz. I have like put it in garment bags to protect it. And yeah. And this is, uh, this. I put this here so that it looks pretty. It's kind of kid's closet. So it should look like a kid's closet. What do you think? And these hangers I purchased from Amazon and it came in a pack of 12. Extremely useful. There is amazing storage in here and I absolutely love it. As you can see, I'm able to put a lot of stuff on top of, top of this platform. Uh, starting with this one, it is actually a desk stationery organizer where you keep pens and cards and all. But uh, I am using this to organize all of his cosmetics and medicines. It was actually gifted to me, but I will try to find this and link it down below. So here I keep his vitamins and uh, lotion and powder and all and this is like his kajal and nail cutter and some like oil and other stuff and his comb here and uh, that is actually coconut oil like a big pack of it so I like put it uh, take it out and put it inside this bottle. That way it's like much easier for me to use it uh, on him and uh, this uh, organizer thing is like amazing. It is like with a leather finish and it's so easy to clean and stuff and uh, I absolutely love it. That is a gift I received from my sister when my son was born. It had a big pack of uh, baby toiletries and I kept the box because it looks so good. I keep his pair creams and travel toiletries and all those stuff. I only take it out when I need it. So it's all out of the way all the time. This is a baby book again gifted by my sister. Let me take it out. It's a record book where you can uh, paste all the sentimental pics and give them caption and everything. Uh, let me show it to you. My sister started filling it up. Uh, she didn't get time to finish it. This is like a very personal item that you can give to a new mother. It's really good. Like it's really pretty and everything. So yes, uh, I just keep it tucked away in the corner uh, till she is back to complete it. And this basket is the most useful thing you can use in a baby's wardrobe. All their clothes are so small, it is always difficult to like fold it, keep it and find it later on. I have like four of these and uh, keep all his night suits and thermal wear inside this basket. So it's like uh, easy to categorize the clothes as well. 
I will show you each of these baskets and how I fold all his clothes in some time. So beside this basket, I keep uh, keep an album that I purchased and I customized it. It's a project I have been working on for quite some time and will give you a sneak peek of it. So these are the pictures that I, that was taken when right after he was born. And uh, this one is uh, when my husband first saw him in the hospital so i have like captioned all the pictures in it i love this work that i have been doing when my son grows up and when he goes through this album it will be very special moment for me and my son you should always preserve memories like this in album the old school way makes it really precious and uh, i will link uh, the album that i got from amazon in the description below so uh, please do not forget to check it out and this is another uh, harry potter merchandise that i should have shown in my harry potter in the in my merchandise video this is a cake topper that uh, my friend bagishri gifted this to us it was like a cake topper and was used on his first birthday on top of his cake it's really special so yeah that's the main section i hope i have covered everything in here and i hope you like the organization and this is how i have organized all his things inside the drawer um, let me take out this pouch so that i can show everything properly okay <laughs> this is really funny this is like a fake passport that my son received from an air hostess uh, it's for kids with like stories and everything and there's also a message from her and team so i thought it was really sweet and i kept it to show him when he's all grown up and this is another thing i use when i'm traveling with my son it is a gold mine guys it is a garbage bag roll to dispose of dirty diapers when you're traveling and is like of this decomposable plastic so it's environment friendly and this uh, comes with a hook to hang it with your bag like your traveling bag and you can purchase the poly rolls and refill it it is like so so 100 percent useful i've been using these small plastic baskets to keep all his small items like uh, socks gloves and napkins and all those things uh, these are like six baskets with uh, different colors uh, in this one i keep all his napkins and uh, this is like what do we call it uh, kamarband with tassels uh, babies in bihar wear these around their like waist during pujas and festivals so yeah so this is a white basket with all his uh, bells and bow ties and all those things and um, this one has bibs and uh, his mask and stuff and this pink one has all uh, the gloves and a beanie uh, when like we go to a place where it's like wintry and the, these two baskets uh, green one and the brown one has all his socks it's quite cold in uh, bangalore always so we like uh, make him wear his socks always so yeah so this is how i have organized uh, all the draw stuff in here like small bits and bobs and this one is like all his medical kit so this is a great tip that i want to share with you all this is like all his uh, medical supplies are in this uh, pouch that i always keep handy whenever i have like an urgent need and i have to travel now here i have uh, two more baskets uh, so one has uh, all his tops uh, and um, this one has all his pajamas and uh, like pants and all those stuff that i like uh, wear, make him wear uh, during the daytime in the house and this is how i have rolled it and kept it all organized and um, this is very easy and manageable it's really easy to pull it out and take all his clothes and in the second basket i have kept all his tops all his t-shirts and tops are in here it's like all rolled up and carefully put in after i'm done with his laundry these baskets i've been using for almost two years now and are still good as new uh, and the folding i will show you exactly how i do it it's super simple and you will like save up a lot of space and it all looks so pretty once you roll it and keep it like this 
these clothes are so small and it's really annoying when it's scattered inside the cupboard uh, this way you save up a lot of space and have easy access and categorize however you like it and in the corner i have kept all his swaddle blankets that i used when he was a little baby uh, these are like the softest cloth in this world it's pure muslin and i used to wash it every other day when i used it but its quality is still excellent i have six of these and i still uh, sometimes use it as a blanket for him when we travel and in case any of you don't know what swaddling a baby is i will insert a picture here Every new mom needs this blanket and I will link it below in case you need to check it out. Now let's go to the bottom section and this is the fourth basket and uh, here is where I keep all his diapers. As soon as we get a new diaper packet, I stuff all in here. I use the Tata diapers because we get almost like 40% discount and they are really good. But uh, the problem is they are only available in Star Market. And below this basket, I have kept all his wet mats. Uh, some are gifted and some I myself purchased. Uh, these are good to put on top of your bed and when you are putting your baby in uh, cloth nappies so yeah and this is the biggest basket i have this is made of jute and uh, i got it from amazon it's a nice and big basket with joy written here and i use it to keep his banyans like vests sweaters his uh, jeans and outdoor pants and shirts that he wears when we take him out uh, this basket is like super big uh, that if you have big enough space in your closet, you can also use it to put your clothes in and we can also use it to put toys in. This is like a multi-purpose basket. I really like it. Now let's go to the topmost shelf. Uh, these are like his fuzzy winter blankets. The top two I got from my hometown. The third one uh, is uh, gifted by a friend these are other blankets that i haven't really used and i might donate these um, this blanket is super soft and really expensive it's uh, this velvety soft material i wish i could get a bigger size of this blanket for myself it is that good uh, really guys look at it how beautiful it is it has the star prints on top it's amazing uh, this blue one is similar to the pink one one was gifted and one i purchased myself and uh, this side i have kept his school bag um, as uh, he uh, don't really go to school but we are like attending online school with activities and all so i keep all his school related um, things in here i really like this bag it was also gifted but i think it's available online and behind the bag, I keep a travel pouch with all smaller travel pouches inside. Uh, and I also keep a nebulizer. Uh, this thing is very useful. It is awful when children has a chest congestion. And I personally feel this is the only thing so far that is truly effective on kids, even on adults. So I use this Dr. Morpin uh, nebulizer. So that's it for this video guys. I hope you guys enjoyed and found it useful. Please do let me know in the comment section below in case you yourself use any particular tip that I will find useful. That will be really appreciated. Thank you so much. I will be seeing you in my next video. Bye guys.